Howdy y'all, I am Ice Gold, and happy Friday to everybody watching this, wherever y'all are at. Uh, I wanted to get on the mic today and say, uh, and not do peeve, that's that's one thing that's for certain, I'm not, I did not want to do peeve today, so I was lucky that uh, September 13th fell on a Friday. Friday the 13th, interesting. But, September 13th, let's look back at that date. A year ago... It really, okay, so it has been a year, right, since I uploaded a video, a little short, like, five-ish minute video titled, It Was Inevitable, detailing my return to the game and uh, making content on this game, because for those unaware, uh, why is this still lighting the blue? I don't know, but for those unaware, I used to make... Uh, Wiz content under the name Julo PvP. This was way back. This was in 2020. Older viewers will know. Uh, you know, I've mentioned it a few times. It's probably been a minute since I've mentioned it, but I do not want to forget those days um, because, truthfully, I was definitely enjoying you know my main content a lot more back then. Um, but it's been a year. Uh, since I since I came back because I, I left Julo PvP behind in November of 2020 with the caramel update uh, Technically I stuck around till like mid-December or something just uploading sporadically, but then almost three years later I Decided that I wanted to come back and that was because of you know a number of things I had uh, I had actually been interested in PvP again because it was a completely different game and I was like, you know what? I want to give this another shot. So that's what I did. And I, well, I won't lie and say that I'm happy with the state of PAVE, but I think that is ultimately for another video. I'm not here to complain forever. You can open your eye now. I probably won't actually open its eye because I can't go in there, but that's cool. But, but you, get the, you get the point. I, it's been a year since I decided to come back and what a year it's been and I am so thankful that I've got nearly 3,000 of you watching this uh, or at least subscribed to the channel and that's a number that I I did not fathom back back when I started this channel again I initially got back into uh, with content you know like I'd been doing raids with Liam's Guild and um, just like generally prepping for PvP again. It certainly took me quite a while. I feel like it still took me a month after I restarted my channel to actually get back into queue, but that's whatever. And yeah, I mean, it's just been, it's been one hell of a year. And I know that I've gotten a lot more busy this last month. And truthfully, like just to, just to throw this little nugget in there, uh, this last month of my life has been probably the best since I graduated high school in June of 2021, and I've uh, I've spent a lot of it off Wiz, so you know take that as you will. I'm still gonna be here, but yeah, I uh, <laughs> I have a life as it, as it were. So if I if I do miss an upload, just uh, just know I'm. I'm doing my thing, and I'm, I'm real I'm real happy these days. You know, the world is a lot more beautiful than it was before. Um, and, yeah, I mean, I'm, like, not to, not to get too much into my life story, but when I restarted this channel, I was, you know, still toward the, the beginning few months of, like, a transitory phase in my life. And, you know, it took a long time, but I got to where I was going. I got to where I was shooting for. And uh, that's why this this last month has been so great. And I guess I just wanted to take this time to briefly say that, but then also go over you know the best the best parts of the 12 months that I've spent on uh, YouTube as of late. So let's go ahead and start with September. And I mean I've said this before in the video, but coming back that definitely was up there and. I mean, just seeing the support that I got, it's like I actually got a lot more views than I was expecting when I started making the, you know, best uh, gear setup videos, which I've done, you know, three installments of now, but the fire gear setup, that was my second video 
since coming back. It was the, it was the first one after it, it was inevitable, right? And um, that one got a lot of views, and it really like catapulted me, I guess, into the spotlight as like a new rising Wiz creator. And I was really happy about that. It it showed me that I could I could do it. You know, because I've never broken through like I have with this channel. And seeing that, it was like once I saw that I was getting like views and support and subscribers, it's like I, I knew I had to put my foot to the grindstone and like get on the grind. You know, it's, it's like make content for y'all, do my thing, and do it in my own way. Absolutely, just like the highest quality that I could provide. Uh, so that's what's up. So that was the highlight of September. Just knowing that I had a place in this community as a creator. I was, I was really happy to see that. Uh, and I want to thank everybody who has been supporting me since then. I know it's not many, but, you know, the people that subscribed to me last September, that was, uh, I like, I thank you a lot. Like, I got to 200 subscribers because uh, I came back with about 145 after my break because I had about 150 as Julo and I lost some naturally over time over the three years. But I got to 200 very quickly very rapidly so i was like okay sure <laughs> go for it and then yeah that uh, that brings us to october and october was also a very very good month for the channel uh, that was when i made my first um like, like, like there were there were a lot of very successful videos from that time i ranked the seven schools in pve for for the first time in october and that is one of my most viewed videos to date that has like i think 10,000 views and then my couch potato farming guide like the the top three spots to, to farm couch potatoes that i think has maybe 12,000 views maybe more and yeah it, it's like there were I, that month i met with a lot of success and that was what really putting me up and I'm I'm just <laughs> I don't want to say it too too much but that really did make me happy and I'm glad that y'all supported me I know that there's a lot more people in the audience today who supported me since October rather than September but that's what's up but I think my highlight my highlight was neither of those videos that I mentioned I think my highlight was when I was talking about how the barrier to entry in PvP was too high and uh, this was back when, this was like a couple weeks before I uh, was peeve ready on uh, like any of my characters really. But I made that video because, you know, I was still fresh. I was still, you know, remembering the glory days of 2020 where, you know, it would be so easy to get into peeve. It's like you just need like maybe one to two dragoon pieces and like, like Malister gear would suffice and you'd be fine. But now you need all this extra stuff, so. I, I talked about that in that video back in October, and it really sent me up. It's like that was the first time I'd ever broken through in this community. I was getting so many views on that video, and I was just really, really happy to, to see that. It's like y'all, y'all support, y'all support really got me through, and I can't thank you enough, seriously. So that, and I'm losing connection. I hope the servers aren't dying. That would be. Very sad if that was the case. Um, interesting. Okay, so it teleported me all the way back here. Cool. But yeah, that's uh, that's October for you. My my highest moment in October was making that video, and like it, it was kind of a complainy video, but it's it's like knowing it's like I already knew from from the gear setups that um, that I that I could you know provide content to people, like people would want to watch my content, uh, but then October, it's like that video showed that there was still interest, and I was like, okay, well, thank, thank everybody so much <laughs> for, for all of that, seriously, and that brings us to November, and November was certainly a quieter month, um, Wallaroo came out that month, and, you know, I did, I did streams of it, I, I streamed on Test Realm, and... I don't know what my highest moment that month was. I really just could not give you the best of answers. I think I think my highest moment that month might have been yeah that back then that was when my most successful video was when I made a video on the best places to farm Arc One spellements, 
and that one really went hard. <laughs> it's, it's like, I, I was really glad that y'all were willing to watch that, and, you know, I, I was happy to provide, you know, I was happy to be of service, you know, it's, it's like making guides is something that I like doing, because it's like guiding other players to, you know, become the, the best, I guess, um, that's something that I just like to do, and it's like elevating other people, uh, and showing them how to do it, that's, that's why I'm here, <laughs> that's, uh, that's why I love being a creator so much, it's like that was, that was a big part of that, and, you know, I, I did, I did make some more guides, uh, around that time, and, yeah, I mean, November, it was definitely not as, you know, prestigious as October or even December, but it was a, it was a nice little chill month type deal. I was still, you know, coming into my own. I think that was when I hit 500 subscribers in November. I think it would have been the 8th, if I'm not mistaken. So, I'm, I'm happy about that. <laughs> so, that, that's what's up. That was November. For December, I think, I think my favorite part of, you know, being a Wiz creator in December Probably, I want to say, my uh, collab video with Val, and that was where we talked about the Wizard 101 official Discord, and how, you know, it was really not so great that the, that, that the Discord was the only thing that existed and not the forums. It's like, there, there were some real problems. There were some real problems uh, with the Discord. Some have been resolved, many have not, but <laughs> that's... Uh, I still really enjoyed making that video, and it's like, it was, it was just a, it was a good time, you know what I'm saying, it's like, that was, uh, I don't really know how else to really describe it, it was just a good time, I loved working with Val, and, I mean, it, it was a successful video, I think people liked seeing it, I, I do like talking about stuff like that, and just like, addressing community news, and community concerns, and, and whatnot. So, yeah, that was, uh, that was, that was where we were at in November, or not November, but December, so, that, uh, that capped off the year 2023, so, I ended that with about 900 subscribers, I want to say, and then, very quickly into 2024, we get to January, and my, like, I'd be lying if I said hitting 1,000 subscribers on the 8th of January 2024 was not my favorite moment of that month because that month was also a little more chill in terms of you know, you know the the content. Um, I did I did rant about ice. It's like that was a that was a whole thing, and then yeah, January just hitting a thousand subscribers. It's like I I am genuinely so happy that all of y'all are here and are watching my videos and my first thousand. I mean, hitting a thousand, it's like I had had channels that hit, you know, 200, 250 subscribers, but this was my first channel that got to 300, um, and then from there it's just, all of it has just been like new milestones for me personally, so, you love to see that, you really and truly do love to see that, so, yeah, that, that was probably my favorite moment from January, just, um, I feel the love, and... That was, uh, that was just a good time. And, yeah, I mean, what else is there to say? It's like, I ranted about ice and I hit a thousand subscribers. That's what happened in January. In February, ooh, February, that was, uh, that was the month with the almond controversy. That was the whole thing. Uh, I'd be glad if y'all don't know what that is. If y'all are a little too new to know, to know what that, uh, what that was all about. And, uh, but it, it, it showed... I do, I, I, I do see the positive in that whole situation, in that all of us got together to denounce elitism and, yeah, you know, like hurtful, you know, name calling and like defamation and all that within the Wiz community, and I, it's, it's like that was when, that was when like I was part of just like such a great community that that was when i knew that the community that i was in was a very good community and i loved just seeing everybody you know band together and say like wow you know this it, it, it's like we need to promote positivity we need to promote positivity and i was 
I, I was down for that. It's like I didn't I didn't really make a video, you know, do dogpiling almond as, as some people would say, but it's like seeing it's like that is the most united our community has been, and I'm very glad that we've got like a tight knit community of whiz tubers that all really really care about the game, and it's uh, it's just real. I, I love being a part of this community. It's like February was the month that I really sort of understood that. So there was that. That was February. And then I also made the gear guide in February, which now has over 30,000 views. So we will go figure. <laughs> We're like a third of the way to 100K, which is kind of insane. But yeah, I mean, again, just whiz, you know. <laughs> it's, it, it's a great game, and I love being here. March. Oh, that. Yeah, okay. So March. <laughs> I would be lying if I said that my crowning moment in March was not my like eventual success at lobbying the devs to buff Frost Giant because that was when the Arc 2 spell limits were coming out uh, and in the process of being rolled out and Frost Giant was pitiful at first you know it was going to do 505 damage to keep the stun after I had made so many videos talking about like you know don't do that just make it a pure damage AoE just you know give us this and they refused and refused and refused and you know they did their thing the devs, the, the, the devs just they do what they do and ignore the community but eventually eventually us as a community we were all able to create i guess a, a set of arguments that finally got them to cave and it's like the one the one that was the most effective was like the new player type thing because ice is the only ice was rather the only school that experienced you know our aoe our main hit being just that much more pitiful than everybody else so it's like the devs finally understood that and buffed it just base from 460 to 570 and then 615 with elements so I'm happy with it. I I'm happy with really anything. Um, <laughs> like just to, just to be totally clear, and yeah, it's it's like it, it wasn't the buff that we wanted, but it was a buff, and it was a substantial buff of that. So I'm just I'm really happy that the devs listened to us for once. So that was my favorite part of March <laughs> on on Wiz. So that brings us to April, and you know, April. Hmm. There was April was honestly kind of a quieter month. I I was streaming a lot, that's for sure, uh, and you know interacting with chat and you know meeting people in my chat and people who stuck around that type of thing. It's like the streams in April. I I was really really happy about. It's like Wiz on a budget went up. You know I was I was I think I was still questing my balance. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I was questing my balance because uh, I had just taken taken him out of Exalted, so that way I could level him up to Max for Beef. And I also that that was also the Cantrip chest farming streams, so that was real fun. Um, but you know, it's it's like I it, it's like I met Firestarter 101 uh, through those Cantrip chest farming streams. It's like he'd, he'd been in my chat before, but that. That was just a great experience. There he is, just logging on right now. And um, that's what's up. Go subscribe to him. But it's like April was like, I didn't really, it wasn't like a super great month for my channel necessarily, but it was a great month for my community. And I, it was still growing, but I was just, I was just happy <laughs> with where I was at the time. And that brought us to May. And May. May was also a little bit of a quieter one. Uh, I did hit 2,000 subs toward the end of the month. I got, like, I think the most subscribers I gained in a day might have been 28, and that was on the day that I hit 2,000. And, you know, I was streaming. I had just, I had just moved into, like, a, a crappy little apartment that, I, that I'm not at anymore, but um, I moved in there. And, you know, uh, I was like my first stream there, I was questing my balance through Imperia, and uh, I hit 2,000 subs. It's like everybody sort of came out 
and supported me. And look, I am so thankful for all of you who were there at that stream getting me to TK. I really appreciate it. And yeah, I mean, I'm, I probably sound like a broken record, but I really, really do appreciate all of that. So that was May. And then in June, we got to June, and I think probably the best part of June was when I had finally finished that uh, 25 Ice Games video. I I can't lie, I I did still enjoy Ice PvP at the time, and it was it was still fun. It was definitely it was definitely still fun ish back back then, and that was probably my favorite PvP meta. Probably like May to June before the summer update came out. That was probably my favorite PvP meta to play in uh, to play Ice in. Uh, in in recent times, at least, Ice has just been bottom of the barrel forever, because you know Rapier just doesn't listen to us. But yeah, I I was actually I think that was the most I enjoyed PvP, and uh, like as crazy as that might sound, it really was the most that I enjoyed uh, PvP. So just enjoying playing the game. <laughs> we'll we'll say that's what it was for June, and then for July. July. I yeah, in July I made a few guides, most notably the pet training guide, and you know, I, I just interacted with my community. It was a real great time. Loved doing it. But I think my favorite part of July would have been making the uh, shouting out other Wiz creators for, for like 14 minutes. <laughs> that that video, I loved doing that video and you know I've, I have been busy this last month, as I said, but I do want to make a follow-up to that video. I've got a couple creators in mind, but a couple others have sort of, you know, as school has started uh, and class and all that, it's they've sort of slowed down their content, which I can respect, uh, and now is probably not the greatest of times to uh, make a second shout-out video, but... We're looking for them. <laughs> it's it's like if you if you are a budding Wiz creator, it's like I love lifting people up and like I I do still look on Twitch sometimes to find some to find some streamers and, and just people that make quality content. It's like all of that is game. <laughs> so if you like, I really would like to make another video like that. So definitely, you know, like I, I will check out y'all channels if if you do comment. So, just say what's up, and who knows, maybe I might come through a stream, I might check out your videos, I've seen a few good videos from people uh, since that video, since my last video where I chatted people out. So, yeah, I, I want to make another one, because doing that in July, it felt so good to see, like, like I, I there need to be more creators in, in this space, so it's like, if I can do anything to help with that it's like that's one of my that's one of my goals as a creator here in this community it's like i want to see more people doing it more people getting at it and more people succeeding at it and if i can help with that i'd love to do it so <laughs> yeah just leave a comment tell me what's up and i'll check you out i'll check you out and you might you might end up in the second video so that's what's up that's for july and then for august yeah, the second half of August was a bit of a blur in terms of Wiz. I, I did finish up the 50 games, but I think that might be the low light of the month. I'm going to be so for real. Um, but I think... Yeah, I don't really know. I, I don't... I, like, August was my best performer month yet, I want to say. Um, so it's like, thanks to thanks to everybody for all the support. Um Oh yeah, and for July I hit 2,500 subs, which is which is a big milestone for me. So thank you all for that. But for August, for August, for August, for August, for August. Um, yeah, I mean, real life was just like my the best part of my August. I'll be so for real. But I guess just everybody supporting me and coming out for that through all of the the pvp videos those got those really popped in august i'll, I'll be real um but yeah thank you to everybody who came through and watched some of those i really you know I, i've said it so many times but i really appreciate all of you for for coming through and uh watching my content it's it makes me feel fulfilled and it makes me want to stay on the platform so 
Bez, what's up? Thank y'all. <laughs> Thank y'all, seriously. And then for September, September 2024. Maybe it's maybe it's yet to come. Maybe it's yet to come. I feel like it's like you, there are some months where like nothing really notable happens, but we'll see. We'll see what it's like in September. Um, I feel like I'm closing in on 3,000 subscribers. That might happen in the next few days here, and like my birthday is is coming up in six days. So. Shoot, I mean, I know I'm, I'm real close. I might hit 3K before then, but but I, I mean, that's what's up. So just thank y'all, all of y'all, for watching my my content over the past year. Um, I can't promise I'll be here forever, but I can promise that I will be here for the time being. <laughs> I will I will stay around and make content for y'all for. For a while, for, for a while, that's what I'm gonna say. So, thank y'all for watching. I've been Ice Gold. Be sure to like, subscribe, and leave like the comments for the algorithm. My Discord is down in the description if you want to chat with me some more. And I will see y'all later.